everyone. I normally have my space heater on, but I'll cut in some footage of how noisy that is. Um, so it's cold. I'm cold in this room. I'm wearing a hat to keep myself warm. My fingers are turning blue, so I'm gonna try and get this done really quickly. This video is about a product that failed on me. The product that failed on me is the newer microphone stand. This, but this. <laughs> And it failed on me pretty interestingly. It bent, as you probably saw in the thumbnail. So a little bit of context. Four years ago, I wanted to work on my stream. So I invested a bit of money into buying an interface, a microphone, and a microphone boom arm. Now I checked out all the specs. The microphone I bought was the one that I'm using right now, the E835 Sennheiser. It's it's the, basically the same as an SM58. The important part of this microphone isn't how it works. The important part is how much it weighs, which is 330 grams. Along with the mount that I had for it, it was only about 400 grams total. Now the newer microphone arm stand, suspension boom scissor mic arm stand with 3.8. This microphone arm is supposed to have a maximum load of 1.5 kilograms. And while I was using the Sennheiser, that was fine. It was well below that. The problem came because I wanted to upgrade my microphone. I thought my sound would be better if I used a condenser microphone. I'd be able to get closer. I'd be able to use the different polar patterns for different kind of environments. I had a reason to buy it. I wanted to upgrade to something that sounded a little bit better than a dynamic microphone. And that was this microphone. And this microphone sounds lovely. I think this microphone is a lot better than the previous one. I think it comes, it has a lot higher quality than the previous microphone. But there is a problem with this microphone. It is a lot heavier, as you can see on screen here. It weighs 710 grams. But that, I thought, mistakenly, that the 710 grams was the microphone and the shock mount. But that is not the case. <laughs> okay, let's zero it out. This is a Newton scale. This uses gravity to measure how heavy something is. So we're going to measure how heavy the uh, Sennheiser is. As you can see, it weighs around 300 grams. Not bad. That's pretty accurate to what it's supposed to weigh, yeah? So now we're going to try the, the Rode microphone and try not to tip it over while we're doing it. Okay. So this is 700 grams or so. But then we have the shock mount. This is included in the product. It is the best way to use a microphone to prevent any kind of like murmurings or anything from you holding it or from, you know, someone knocking something downstairs or a car going past. This shock mount weighs, holy shit. This shock mount takes it over to 130 grams or so. So 100, whoop, that's too loud. The ADHD got to me here. I kept saying kilograms, but it's supposed to be rated for 1.5 kg and it failed at less than 1.3 kg. It's really annoying. Why did it fail that early? Because it's a piece of shit. It costs 20 quid. I don't know what I expected out of it really. So fuck newer, to be honest. And I decided to buy myself something new. I've bought a new boom arm which is the Elgato Wave Mic Boom Arm. And the microphone weight is up to one kilogram per microphone. So I'm gonna be installing that today and seeing if that is going to work better and not fucking break the same way the newer did. So it's the Elgato Wave Arm. Oh God, this website, why, why do people design it? Look, no one likes this. Just let me have real scroll back, please, please. Yes, yeah, so it's the Elgato Wave Arm. I've heard a lot of cool things. I see a lot of professional streamers using it. It did cost me 80 fucking quid, however, and I don't have any money at all. So this is, this is all being fixed by a gracious donation from Alice. Um, thank you so much, Alice. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna install that now and fix that. And yeah, that's that's the rest of the video. You get to install a thing with me. I don't care if it's not interesting. I'm gonna be abusing a selfie stick for this. Wow, well, selfie stick? A, a, a phone clamp is what it really is. But I'm gonna be abusing this for my microphone. It's not a permanent replacement. This is why I needed the Elgato um, because this guy droops over time. This doesn't feel safe. I'm a professional. I'm I'm a professional. I'm a professional. I'm a professional. I'm a trained professional. Trained professional. Trained professional. Trained professional. Trained professional. Trained professional. TikTok gets real mad at you if you use a knife, even though they're just like, it's a daily thing. You just everyone uses a knife all the time. I use knives all the time. It's normal. Ooh. 
pretty. Measurements? Oh, that should be fine. Okay, so it comes with a little pouch. And the little pouch contains an Allen key. Tiny one. And then these adapters that go for um, microphone screws. There's obviously the little stand die. Raise it up a bit. There's the heavy duty clamp guy. Look at that. That's heavy. That's, it's, it's heavy. Then there's the um, counterweight, which we might use, we might not, depends on how heavy it is. And then this spring loaded, I am so scared of, because it even says, caution, spring loaded. So that's, that's terrifying. It's the first time I've ever read instructions. Oh, so you can tighten it, clamp, push, tighten it, clamp, push, tighten it. That's nice. So it's, it's, a, it's a built in ratchet, that's neat. Ratchet type. Okay, let's do this. Okay, this is gonna be the quiet bit where I switch microphone on, switch this microphone on to here. Yeah, so that's the video. That's that that that's it. That I uh, done. Uh, GG's new mount, new mic. Well, the microphone's my old microphone until I can put the new one on. Uh, the new one has this mount. It needs this mount. This guy. I say new one. I've had it for like two years. This guy needs this mount. Uh, I only have these dynamic microphone mounts, which are helpful because you know this guy's a dynamic microphone, so I have at least one mount working. Um, but yeah, I'll need to get a new. I need to get a new mount to use this guy. So I'm gonna do that. I'm gonna get a new mount and then I'll be back with my large diaphragm microphone in future. Uh, that's the video, bye, see you, bye, 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 bye.